name's uh, Mauricio Lainez. I am the product development manager here at Security Door Controls. And I'm here today to uh, introduce our IP Pro Access Control solution. Uh, we have our IP Pro Starter Kit, which uh, consists of the IP Pro Single Door Controller, the IP Pro Injector, and the IP Pro Splitter. The Starter kit is available in with either just the PC board or it's also available as part of a board with enclosure and then the you also it also includes one injector and one splitter. Also on our demonstration here we have uh, a uh, an industry standard Wigan output uh, card reader uh, connected and we're using the IP controller to control uh, one of our uh, SDC Hightower brand locks. The, just to go into a few features of the IP controller, um, it is an IP uh, enabled device, which means it requires an Ethernet network connection. Uh, the unit can be powered using a 12 volt DC power supply, or like we've done here, we are using, uh, we're taking advantage of the uh, Ethernet uh, capability to uh, to power the unit uh, using power over Ethernet. The unit itself uh, has uh, many of the basic uh, components of, of any access control uh, panel. Uh, you've got uh, inputs for an entry and exit reader. You've got uh, an input for door contact for uh, prop door or force door alarms and you have an input for a request to exit uh, input. Uh, as far as outputs go, you have a main relay to uh, control your lock and you have uh, a secondary auxiliary relay to control auxiliary devices. So the unit itself only requires an IP address, so that makes it easily scalable. Uh, you're really only limited to the number of IP addresses available on your network. Um, like I said, uh, it uses uh, an existing, uh, you're able to use your existing Ethernet infrastructure, so uh, additional, additional cabling isn't required. There are uh, just some of the general software features. You have uh, 15,000 users, 250 user groups, 250 time zones are available for, for user access schedules and for uh, scheduled events and you also have a 5,000 uh, transaction event log. One of the key features of the IP controller is its built-in web server. The built-in web server allows you to communicate to the IP controller using any standard web browser. So logging into the controller is as easy as opening up a web browser, typing the IP address of the IP controller, and when I do that, it automatically brings up an authentication window for me, so I put in a valid username and password, and now I'm into the system. Now from the interface, uh, from the home page, I can add new users, add cards as a batch. If I add a user or a batch of cards, it automatically assigns all the users to group one, which is a 24-hour group which has access to all doors. The interface also gives me a real-time status of all my doors. I've unlocked the door and the status of the door on the interface changes telling me that the door has been unlocked. The report section allows me to see the a real-time log of all the events that are occurring and it also allows me to export those events into an Excel file. If you have multiple controllers on your system, the interface allows you to back up a database of all your users and schedules and transfer it to other controllers. This gives you the ability to set up multiple controllers without repeating multiple tasks. 